Hello, baby, it's number 12, seven back again, and this is Skype Saturday, where we can entertain you for hours of fun. More or less, for hours of fun, we got a game to a family feud to go. Hopefully we can find funny answers in the game. And I got two Skype guests in the phone stuff. He was in the last video, I still got C3PO 626. Yo. And I got Mikey with us. Hey folks, if you probably don't know by now, I closed my channel down due to a bunch of assholes, motherfucking assholes. Beep! <laughs> Sorry, do you have to refilm that? Welcome to the no. Preview. You can go directly backstage and prepare for the show, or you can go to our Create Your Family selection. This is game two of Family Feud. You need to pick a family. So here we go. Game two of fun in... Well, you know... The fun and the funnier. They're from the Beaver State, and they describe themselves as outrageous, but mostly witty. <laughs> for family number one. Michigan, and they describe themselves as secure, but mostly attractive. Give it up for family number two. These two families will be going head to head on the Family Feud. Here is the host of our show, Louie. Family feud, everybody. Let's have some good old-fashioned family fun. Good luck, everybody. Okay, yes, so I'll meet him. Luke. You know the drill. A hundred people did the survey. Top five answers up on the board. Good luck. You ready to do this? You. Name something you can yeah. never find when you need one. Number one. Have an idea, Ben? Name something you can you can never find when you need one. How about um Corey? Uh what's the question? Name something you can never find when you need one. Name something you can never find when you need one, right? Yeah. Keys. This is never bit odd. Two, you give it a shot. Your answer, family number two. Scissors. Let's see if it's up there. I ain't gonna be up there. All right. Oh boy. Exactly. Play or pass? What do you want to do? Pass 
All right, then. That's all right. There we go. Name something you can never find when you need one. I hope it's up there for you. Number two. Good answer. <laughs> Next player, it's your dad. Uh -oh. I knew that was going to happen. Name something you can never find when you need one. Um. Lost my key. Oh boy. Name something you can never find. I don't know if it's gonna try up there. How about books? I hope it's up there for you. Oh, oh well. It's not up there. Strike number one. Oh. Another player, okay. Got an answer for us? Name something you can never find when you need one. Sorry, damn computer. That's all right. And I what put... Place officer up there? Yeah, and when I put bu uh, books, strike one. Uh, how about, um, uh, a good, a good stripper? <laughs> 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 I can't look at it up there! <laughs> <laughs> There. Sorry, that's two strikes. Oh. Maybe a car, man. A good car. And you get a chance yeah. to steal. Another player, okay. A stripper. An for us? Yeah. <laughs> Name something you can never find when you need one. A car. I want to see that answer. Good answer, but it wasn't in our top five. <laughs> so yeah, we can find a pretty good stripper. Next family, it's your Same team. Same thing. Next player, and we just got off the. Name something. Name something you, you can, can never, never find, find when you need one. one. A man. We got police officer. We got scissors. Show us. And then he put a man. How about we got the points? Good answer, but it wasn't in our top five. Yes, family number one gets the points. Now, there's one, three, five. What was our most popular answer? Who was in third place? Pen, pencil. And to wrap things Neo, up. Neo, pen. Telephone booth. That's the end of round one. Let's see how both families are doing. 27 to zip. Family number one, you're playing great. Right. Let's go. It's time for round two.
survey to 100 people. Top seven answers are up on the board. Oh, Here boy. we go. Are you ready? Name an everyday item that people make into a makeshift musical instrument. What do you think it is, family number one? In case you miss it, name an everyday item that people make into a makeshift musical instrument. Uh, pot. I want to see that answer. Number three, pots and pans. Woohoo! Good answer. But there's a couple that can beat it. So let's see what our next family says. That's number three. What do you think it is, family number two? An empty jug. Good answer! Good answer! Is it up there? I say number six. It's not! Good answer, but it wasn't in our Play top seven. Play it? Play or pass? Yeah, well, what do you want? All right. Family number one, one I know going to play. No. Name an everyday Name item everyday that people item make people into a makeshift make musical instrument. instrument. Rubber bands? Strings, rubber band. Uh, put it as rubber bands. I think that's probably specific. Austin has three, one then seven. Another player, okay. An answer Tissue the... box. I never thought of it. Name an everyday item that people make into a makeshift Tissue musical box. instrument. That's right. Why... Whoops. That's what I said. All right. Show me that answer. I'm going to love it in the morning, answer. That's strike number one. Oh. Hot hands for the band. Another player. We need another answer. Strings. Name an everyday item that people yes. make into a makeshift musical instrument. Is it there? Show us. No, that won't be up there anyways. It's a good answer, but sorry. Next. Your second strike. Oh. One more strike and you're up, family number two. Next player, let's go. Convert. Name an everyday item that people make into a makeshift musical instrument. Turn another. Shoot. Name an everyday items that people make into a makeshift musical instrument. Did you say rubber band or strings? No, rubber band seven strings give us a second strike. How about no? Oh? Don't say a tissue box, that's the first strike. Yeah. You make shit into a musical instrument? <laughs> Disgusting. <laughs> 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 Mikey, bitch, laugh. Ow. Mikey, shit, and I'm gonna choke about it. <laughs> yeah. 
surveyed twice that's a hundred people we got top four answers you just got to give them to us ready name something you need to get into medical school a diploma okay diploma let's see if it's up there Diploma. College degree. That'll work. Number three. Very good. But there's two up there that can beat it. Next family gets a chance. Family number two. Patience. I don't think that's up there. Good answer. Good answer. Is it up there? That's a strike. Good answer, but it wasn't in our top four. Play or pass. Play or pass? pass play, what do you want? I, I I you gonna play? All right. All right. Now, college. Name something. Name something you need, to get, you need to get into medical school. school. Good answer. Good answer. Is it up there? Number two. Okay, that'll work. Out. Good answer. Good answer. <laughs> <laughs> Name something you need to get into medical school. Name something you need to get into medical school. Name something you need to get into medical school. Good grades. I'll just say recommendation. 
Now we're gonna figure out the number four. Okay, okay. Got an answer for us? Welcome. How do you spell that? I don't know. Name something you need to get into medical school. Corey Lewis. No. <laughs> medical school. Good grades, money, college degree. Maybe a tu tuition? An intuition? Yeah. Ain't gonna be up there? Would that be the same as college degree, though? I wanna see that answer. An intuition. But no. We're trying to figure out what's number four. Oh. Another player, okay. Got an answer for it? We got good grades, money, college degree. Name something you need to get into medical school. Okay. Show me the answer. I'll take it. Right. Intelligence. All of them. Well done. Give family number one those points. We got it. We set the ball too. That takes us to the end of this round. Let's check the scoreboard. Ninety-nine twenty-seven. One twenty-six. To this is a close game. I guess we'll decide it in the final round. That's what we do. In round four, points are tripled, but you only get one strike. Then the other family gets a chance to steal. Let's play. There we go. Come on, another player from each family. Hundred people surveyed. Top six answers up on the board. Yeah, We're looking right. for the most popular answer. Good luck. You ready to do this? Even though you don't have a cavity, name another piece of bad news that a dentist could give you. Uh, Sorry, time's up. What the fuck? Let's try this again, and we'll put up another survey on the board. Fifty people surveyed twice. That's I tried to buzz people. in. Four answers. You just gotta give them to us. Here we go. Ready? Name something that little children bring to school for show and tell. Yes. Toy. Family Toy. number one. I want to see that answer. Number one. Number one. Number one. <laughs> Number one! Boys, dolls? Yeah! Our top answer. Way to go. We need a decision. Play We're gonna play it. Family number one is going to play. You gotta think carefully about this and fuck up once. Then hopefully, damn that sad. Dolls. Name something that little children bring to school for show and tell. Uh, uh, oh wait, would teddy bear be under dolls? That'd be under, yes. How about pictures? Pictures. I know. Uh, 
to say pictures for another guest. Um, 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 positive, uh, toy souls. A game! A game? We already have that answer up there. Try again, please. That's in the toys. Um, food. Food. Wait, no, 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 food. Man. Pause it. I did. Toys, games, dolls, that's all covered under that category. Um, 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 oh, shit. A book? A book? Yeah. Book! Yeah. Okay, show me the answer. Number four. Yeah. All right. Exactly. Keep going. Two more. Another player. This is another answer. This will decide that game. Pet. 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 Name something that little children bring to school for show and tell. Me the answer. Number two. Good answer. Good answer. Pictures. Next family member. I just called Name something that little children bring to school for show and tell. Okay. Show me the answer. Picture by Kid Rock. We won! You got all of them. Well done. Yes. Family number one gets the point. Oh yeah, I think we need to be too bleak in mind. I'm gonna save this one. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna mute my uh, sounds. Alright. Nice work, everyone. Thank you. Moving on to our Fast Money Mob is our top money winner. Family number one. And we get a second one going. It's the fast money round. I need two players from your team, and we'll get going. Five questions. Good luck. The clock starts when I finish reading the first question. Okay. <laughs> Name a dessert you see on almost every restaurant menu. Name an animal that can kill a man. How about a bear? Oh my! Name a brand of motorcycle.
Name a dessert you see on almost every restaurant menu. <laughs> it's an ice cream, so it says... Funny! Name an animal that can kill a man. You say a bear, so it says... 24, we're soon for ready. Name a brand of motorcycle. Oh, Davidson! 44! Halfway there. Name a musical instrument that you hold in your hand. Do you say guitar? The best one. Seventeen. Name a present given as a token of love. <laughs> He's in a blow job. <laughs> oh. Same five questions. Good luck. The clock starts when I finish. Call the me. Name a dessert you see on almost every oh. restaurant menu. Hey, I'm Buster and Cory. Uh -huh. Okay, Cory, Mikey got you 135. Get compiled. <laughs> We're going to ask you to do some Tell him about me, boy. You're going to know about it before the end of this. <laughs> no, he didn't. No, he didn't. I can ask you on the final question on this. Because he said something funny. That's not something sexual. Sexual. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we have five questions. If you duplicate, you hear this sound, eh, eh, and we shall try again. Mm -hmm. <laughs> until after. <laughs> yeah. Here we go. Question. Time's going to start after I finish that first question. Here we go. Name a dessert you see on almost every restaurant menu. Uh, ice cream. Uh -uh. Pie. There we go. <laughs> Name an animal that can kill a man. Name an animal that can kill a man, a lion. Name a brand of motorcycle. Harley Davidson. Eh, eh. Yamaha. Honda. Yamaha. Name a musical instrument that you hold in your hand. Musical instrument that you hold in your hand. Trumpet. Oh, that one. Name a present given as a token of love. Uh -oh. Name a present you give as a token of love. Chocolate. <laughs> you and Mikey said? What? A blowjob! <laughs> Did it score? <laughs> no, I didn't! No, I didn't. <laughs> he said a blowjob! Mikey said a blowjob for a token of love! <laughs> Oh, job! <laughs> you did. Here we go. Name a dessert you see on almost every We're at restaurant 135. menu. I have pie. Forty-six. Number one answer. Name an animal that can kill a man. Name nineteen. Here we can say hello to ten thousand dollars. See you next time on Family Feud. <laughs> 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 
Trump. <laughs> so it's gonna give us eleven thousand three hundred eighty-nine dollars. Right, <laughs> thanks for striking for being part of it. See you all in the next video. Hi, welcome to the